Well, good morning to you. We're talking about you do have what you say. Can't teach this without going to Mark chapter 11. So let me show you what Jesus said. He said, so whosoever shall say unto this mountain. Notice it's a whosoever. That means it can be a believer. It can be a non-believer. This is a whosoever message. Well, I'm a whosoever. You are a whosoever. So if you'll say to the mountain, be thou removed, be thou cast into the sea, shall not doubt in your heart, but believe that those things which you saith shall come to pass. Jesus said, he shall have whatsoever he saith. Now, when he said that, what he was saying there is, you're gonna have what you say, not what you hope for. You're gonna have what you say, not what you're believing for. You're gonna have what you say, not what you're praying for. So you're going to have to realize that you're going to have what you say, so you've got to control your tongue. You've got to control what comes out of your mouth. And what comes out of your mouth should be the Word of God and what the Word says about that situation, not what you look at or see or consider about that. Now notice he said, whosoever shall say. You have to say it three times more than you believe it. So your believing is controlled by what you say, your receiving is controlled by what you say, or in other words, everything that happens in your life is controlled by what you say. I remind you, I've been teaching this for a day or two, thou art snared by the words of your mouth. So if you're gonna have wealth and riches, you're gonna to have to talk wealth and riches. If you're gonna have divine health, you're gonna to have to talk about it and say it. I'm healed, I'm not moved by what's going on. Jesus bore my sicknesses and carried my diseases and with his stripes I was healed. And since I was healed, that means I am healed and I'm gonna stay healed in Jesus' name. Hey, you have a great day and watch what you say because what you say is what you're gonna have. And you remember Jesus is Lord and thank God the word works.